Hi, my name is Jelena Stojšić and as someone who together with my colleagues from Canvas provided support to thousands of activists around the globe, I have had chance to meet and work with some incredible and brave women. We all know that many women played important roles in various resistance movements around the world, from Nicaragua and Cuba to Indonesia and Thailand, from Zimbabwe to Syria and Egypt. Pictures and videos of these brave women were overflowing the internet and mainstream media, but their efforts to lead the movement were often overshadowed by men, who still get more attention and credit for its success in popular narratives. We are aware that the people who are leading and supporting nonviolent movement are essential to its success. In order to achieve our goals, it is important to collaborate with inclusive and diverse set of people with different experiences, so that together we can build a better vision for the future. The inclusion of women will give our movement a necessary variety of perspectives and will encourage others to join and support our cause. In the world of nonviolent activism, the past few years have shown us that the true difference between success and failure is dependent on women's participation. Just think of Sudan, Iraq, Myanmar and hundreds of other movements around the world. Data shows that movements with women, both in the streets and in leadership, are more likely to maintain nonviolent discipline and create a higher rate of defections from security forces compared to the male-dominated campaigns. Because women have been traditionally shut out of political spaces and decision-making roles, their participation in acts of protest, civil resistance and non-cooperation is incredibly powerful. In many cases, women taking up public space is a strong act of defiance. But when you imagine how powerful it is to see thousands of women in a crowd taking up that space, that incredible enthusiasm is so contagious. And that's great because enthusiasm is critical for any movement to maintain its momentum and achieve revolution. Equally important to frontline participation are women's occupation of decision-making roles. Women in leadership positions give movements legitimacy. Why? Because when women are in leadership, it represents the movements internally creating the democratic change that they are demanding of their opponent in the streets. Bringing women into leadership in a democratic manner will serve to help the movement achieve revolution. And if it's sustained and women continue to lead, there's a higher likelihood that the revolution will achieve sustainable peace through the transition. To learn more about the influence of women and the power of nonviolent struggle in creating a better world, please visit our website or social media.